In this video, we're going to take a look at placing pilasters on your cabinets. And in this configuration, I have a bank of three different cabinets. Notice the pilaster configuration. We'll take a look at how to do that, as well as displaying your pilasters in a floor plan view. Let's get started with a bath vanity and look at the process of placing the pilasters. To add the pilasters to the cabinets, I'm going to hold my shift key down and I'm going to select all three cabinets and use the open object command in my lower left hand menu. Pilasters can be found on the accessories panel. I'm going to come over for the front pilaster and I'm going to select the library. I'm going to browse down to the core catalog in architectural underneath millwork and as I scroll down there's a specific category for pilasters. I'm going to go ahead and select the first pilaster and then I'm going to set the width of that pilaster to three inches so we can see this easily in the video. Now above is the information for how to treat this for the left and the right. For right now, let's leave this set on auto and extend these down to the bottom and take a look. Auto does a pretty good job of figuring out where to place those pilasters. Notice that there's not a doubling up of pilasters in between the two cabinet boxes on either side of the middle cabinet. If we go back in and we take a look at that setting once again and we turn it to be on, close the dialog, you can see that it now forces the double pilaster. It could be that this is popped out for a kitchen sink base and you do want a couple of pilasters. That's the process of doing it. Inside of the cabinet dialog, you can turn those items to be on, off, or on auto to control exactly how the pilasters behave. Now as I move back over into the floor plan view and we zoom in a little bit closer, the cabinet pilasters are not currently being displayed on the front of the cabinet. You can find that setting underneath of the defaults, underneath the cabinets, and I'm going to come down to general cabinet. Down towards the bottom of the general cabinet defaults is the option to show pilasters. There's also the option to show closed doors, drawers, and panels in this default as well. Once you turn that on, you can now see where those pilasters are in your floor plan view.